Hey everyone, thank you so much for joining in. Guys, in this particular video of WordPress series, we will understand if you have downloaded any custom font for your WordPress website, then how you can use that custom font and upload that onto your WordPress website so that you can use it locally for your WordPress website without any problem. So here, in order to add a custom font on your WordPress website, what you need to do is, first you need to download the font. So for example, if you want to download any custom font, so you can say, a uh, custom font download so i am just downloading a custom font for free for absolutely free so it just in case if you have already downloaded not a problem you can go ahead so let's say i want to use this font then i need to simply download this and once i download this font it will be downloaded as a zip file so i need to first unzip this file so i'll just open this file click on open with archive or whatever method you want to use you can do that and open in a new folder now i have this font files and the font extension is otf otf and you know there are other like ttf as well if there is another folder like ttf no there is no ttf the either otf or ttf the extension should be there once you downloaded the font now come back to wordpress website go to plugins click on add new plugin and then you need to search for custom font in the search bar once you search for custom font in the search bar you will see this plugin that is custom font host your fonts locally so just click on install now and once the installation is done you need to simply activate this plugin this plugin will help you to upload this font on your wordpress website and use it in your website according to your need once it is done now click on custom fonts so click on settings or you can go in appearance and find the custom fonts here as well so click on this option now it says add new font click on this button you can give a name to your font so in our case the font name was choco right c h o k o so we just need to name it c h o k o and then we need to upload the font upload the file select the file so from here we will add our font so there are two fonts so you can upload any of these so we'll use this one and then click on open and then once it is uploaded now click on use fonts and once it is done now you can see the font is uploaded and now you can make some variation if you want to use it on normal or italic or oblique right or if you want to change the font so let's say if you want to use thin font if you want to use bold font anything based on your need once it is done click on save font once the font is saved now come back to your wordpress website refresh website once so whatever builder you are using just edit with elementor or edit with that builder so i'm using elementor here and once i click on edit with elementor now i need to go here so let's say this is the font which i need to change so click on this now go to styles and click on typography and from font family you need to choose the font that you uploaded so click on here now you can say custom font there is a font called choco that we have uploaded as soon as i click on this now you can see the default font has been changed to my custom font so that's how you can use multiple fonts you can use multiple custom fonts that for your wordpress website you can download them you can use them for free there is no paid plugin required you can download upload on your wordpress website and whatever builder you are using you can use them without any problem so that's it for this video i will see you in the next video till then take care bye bye have a nice day